greasy effects to guitar-driven rock. Toronto's Rush found their signature progtastic sound, and it was never put to better use than 1981's Tom Sawyer. Tom Sawyer is a great hard rock song for one simple reason, that's Rush rules. You've never seen so much musical talent in three dudes. Geddy Lee is singing, he's playing bass, he's playing keyboards, he's playing foot pedals at the same time. And they have all these instruments going at one foot, and I think he's standing there playing the bass, and you just hear... You're like, where is that sound coming from? There were a handful of bands with that kind of progressive rock style that were taking you on these musical adventures, and that's all Rush songs are like that. Tom Sawyer is the ultimate air drum song. Three decades after Tom Sawyer, the 50-somethings of Rush are busier than bands half their age. Their newest, Snakes and Arrows Live, came out in 2008, and touring's never stopped. These guys have left behind such an incredibly huge body of work that you almost need a separate iPod just for your Rush collection. <laughs>